Well, 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 Hurricane Nicole, Wednesday morning update with your boy Brad Flauda. Look at the ocean. All right, guys, well, I'm already, I'm on A1A here. It's uh, Wednesday morning. I'm already seeing the beginnings of flooding happening on A1A. Uh, the ocean is, in my opinion, uh, this is worse than Hurricane Ian as far as the um, the water level already. And maybe I can give you guys a peek here. I, I have another video that I'm putting up. There's there's ocean foam being spit up onto A1A already. And you rarely see that happening. Rarely see that happening. And I live right on A1A and I've lived on A1A for almost 10 years. So I know what I'm talking about. You rarely see ocean foam being spit up onto A1A. Like that's, that means it's going pretty far. But here, let me see if I can give you a little peek here. You see that? The ocean waves, the waves are already hitting um, like the the rocks and the the backstop already of the, of the sand or whatever. But anyway, so right now we're in a holding pattern you know until who knows what happens here today i think the next what 24 hours are supposed to be the, the worst part of it i think i'm not sure um places are already closing down early today i also saw on facebook the daytona beach city council was putting in place an embargo for anyone that lives east of a1a by the way, all of this is east of A1A, so all these condos, they're putting in like a mandatory evacuation for all these condos over here, east of A1A, which means if you live on Oceanside on A1A, all this stuff is east of A1A. See, look at look at the ocean. Woo! But these, I mean, there's look at all these cars. Like, but anyway, so they're afraid, they're afraid that buildings might literally collapse because, I mean, look at this building. I mean, the structure just isn't there, um, you know, because of Hurricane Ian and how much that destroyed with the coastline. Now we got this thing coming. Who knows what this is going to do? I mean, this is already um, look at look at that. I mean, the ocean, like I said, the ocean, there's waves just slamming in into the um, the, uh, the coastline already. Let me see if we can get you guys a peek here. Look at look at this. Let's see if we can get you a peek there. You see the ocean? Do you see that? Look at that. It's coming literally right up to right there. Do you see that? It's crazy. Crazy. I haven't seen the ocean that bad this early in a while. So I don't know what it's gonna look like. Um whew, look at the ocean. Look at the ocean right there. It's crazy. Honestly, I, I'm just hoping it stays just like this. And it's just like this and only this. Because if it gets worse, if we start getting like torrential downpour rain. I mean, it, it is windy. It's windy. I don't know. We'll see. Last time also, Daytona Beach was flooded. Like the actual mainland side of Daytona Beach was flooded. So, um, that, there's your morning update, folks. Like, subscribe, comment down below. I'm going to have quite a few videos coming out today because uh, I got a movie review I got to do too, which I saw. So I'm going to put that up too. But anyway, guys, um, like, subscribe, comment down below. Hope you guys enjoy your day. Stay safe. Oh, one thing I want to talk about too. So gas stations, um, gas stations are fine. You can still get gas. I haven't attempted to go into Publix yet. I'm going to do that later on today. So we'll see. We'll see how Publix is doing later today. I'm going to put them. I'm going to put them to the test actually, and I'm going to make a video about them actually. All right, guys, like, subscribe, comment down below. Peace.